In this illustration, we intend to simulate sliding failure of the masonry wall in the Abacus software. Actually, we had already uploaded a training video titled Masonry Wall under in-plane cyclic loading using Simplified Micro in YouTube channel. Presently, we intend to update the previous training in order to survey the failure mode of the masonry wall and distinguish uh, what that failure mode is. As you know, uh, this video has been simulated based on the present article in which the masonry wall undergoes a cyclic loading and following that, the hysteresis diagram of the masonry wall will be drawn. You can also observe its hysteresis diagram here. Of course, we had already drawn the hysteresis diagram and now we intend to obtain the failure mode of the masonry wall. In short, we intend to update the previous video, obtain uh, the failure mode of the masonry wall, and have a comparison between the results obtained from the Abacus software with those gained from the article. The analysis was done successfully, so I'll click on result. As you observe, the failure mode of the masonry wall is a sliding and this indicates that sliding actually occurs between the first and second row and second row starts sliding over the first row. Now, here I'll fivefold the formation so that the matter can be easier observed.
As mentioned, the main purpose of solving this problem is to obtain the failure mode of the masonry wall. As you observed so far, the failure mode of the wall is sliding, and if we uh, look this up in the article, we will observe that the failure mode of the wall is sliding in the experimental results. In this picture, you can see the sliding failure mode having been displayed in the article. As you observe, the failure mode of the wall has been mentioned as a sliding. As you observe here, the deformation obtained from the Abacus software is very close to experimental deformation and as it can be observed in the right picture in article, the sliding failure mode of the masonry wall can be clearly observed and this matter can also be observed in the Abacus software. In the next step, we intend uh, to draw the hysteresis diagram of the masonry wall. Actually, we intend to draw this diagram here. I will click on Create XY Data, select ODB Field Output, and continue. Here, I'll select Unique Nodal. First, I will select Displacement directed at X, and then Reaction Force directed at X. Here select set 3 and this set 3 is related to the place of uh, cyclic loading. Finally I will click on save. I will click on create uh, XY data, select operate on XY data and continue. Here I will select combine. First I'll select U1 and then RF1 and click on save as. Here uh, you observe uh, the hysteresis diagram drawn in the Abacus software. I will transfer that to the Excel software. The first 
column is displacement, the unit of which is millimeter. The second column is force, the unit of which is newton. Here the diagram having been drawn with blue with blue color is related to the new model or the same new updated model. As you observe, the results obtained from the Abacus software are very close to those mentioned in the article. Actually, uh, our results include two parts. First, the hysteresis diagram and the second is failure mode of the wall as already said the failure mode of the wall is indeed the sliding failure and this is just what has been mentioned in the experimental results the second case is how to obtain the hysteresis diagram and those results from the abacus software proved to be uh, so similar and close to the results in the article. Actually, as it can be observed in this picture, uh, the results obtained from the Abacus uh, software are very close to those results mentioned in the article. Another case we intend to survey is the damage of the bricks. Here I'll select the equivalent plastic strain. As you observe, the plastic strain has grown to a maximum in these areas. And as the results in the article indicate, damage has occurred in these areas. In the left picture, the article results, and in the right picture, the Abacus software results can be observed respectively. Also, in this picture, the failure mode of the wall has been displayed. 